Asus ROG Ally is one of the latest portable gaming consoles with a powerful CPU that supports external GPU connection. Surprisingly, this console can handle CPU-intensive games like a boss and is well-optimized to run the game smoothly. So, in today's video I made a list of the 20 best games for ROG Ally. Assassin's Creed Mirage is, for some fans, a long-awaited return to the roots of the Assassin's Creed franchise. It's a traditional Assassin's Creed game based on stealth, parkour, and taking down Templars. It's disappointing man that the game isn't available on Steam. It's currently exclusive to Ubisoft's store, Ubisoft Connect. However, that's not the end of the world for ROG Ally owners. Not only can you install Ubisoft Connect on the Ally, but it runs magnificently to boot. I've played at a steady 60 FPS while plugged in on low settings, using 1080p with FSR, mighty impressive for a AAA game on a handheld device. The default settings for Power World on ROG Ally make for a rather choppy gaming experience, so you'll want to go in and adjust not only the game's graphics settings but also the ROG Ally's own settings to get the Creature Collecting Survivor game to run well. As part of this process, it's best to allocate 6G of RAM to the GPU in order for the gaming handheld to run smoothly and more efficiently. I suggest you make this change before heading into the game to make settings changes since adjusting VRAM does require restarting the ROG Ally. After the restart, you can go into Power World and make the proper adjustments in the graphics settings menu. For more step-by-step -step instructions on how to adjust the ROG Ally's resolution and the amount of memory assigned to the GPU, check out our Best Power World ROG Ally Graphics Settings Guide. Note that the Microsoft PC and Game Pass versions of Power World are older versions of the game than the Steam one. Additionally, the Steam one works far better on ROG Ally, so if you're trying to decide which version to get, I recommend going with Steam. The Yakuza concept of combat fighting with a samurai sword became real with the like a Dragonition. This game offers impressive combat mechanics and is a real treat for fans who fantasize about controlling the samurai action in a game. This spin-off takes place in 1860 in medieval Japan during the Civil War. The story is indulging, and the slashing combat action is delightfully satisfying. Like a dragon, Ishin gives a fantastic performance on ROG Ally, and it will undoubtedly tooth your taste for slashing combat action. Taking it all back to the medieval times, the game is worth playing in 2024. If you're a sports game fan, EA Sports FC 24 is probably already on your radar. As the first FIFA game not to bear the name, FC 24 is still the same game that dominates sales and playtime around the world. It's also a must-have play for the cross-section of soccer fans and ally owners. In fact, the only way to play FC 24 on a portable PC is to do so on a Windows 1. The game won't run on the Steam Deck due to EA's anti-cheat software being Windows only. That's not a problem on the Ally, and once you're up and running, it's easy to forget you're not playing on a PS5 or desktop. FC24 holds a steady 60 FPS on the Ally and feels just as good to play as on beefier hardware. Despite Baldur's Gate 3 being one of the very best PC games to come out in recent years, the 2023 hit actually isn't all that graphically demanding on GPUs. Still, there are several recommended settings to help you play as smoothly as possible on ROG Ally. Feel free to play at the ROG Ally's 1920x 1080p panel resolution, but to avoid choppiness and strain you'll want to reduce model quality to low, play shadow quality at medium, and have texture quality at ultra. This will make it so that there is a bit more pop-in in the distance from where your character is, but also guarantees plenty of detail in close-by models while allowing the game to run well. Putting the texture filtering at Anisotropic X4 allows the game's visuals to look good as you play, but you'll want to put instance distance down to low to improve CPU performance. Another helpful way to increase performance on Baldur's Gate 3 is by putting the animation level of detail down to low and setting anti-aliasing to temporal anti-aliasing (TAA). This will make it so that the CPU runs better, especially in the more NPC-intensive Act 3. So what is the storyline for Baldur's Gate 3? Anyway, Mind Flayers have captured several people, including yourself, and infected them with a worm that should take over their minds and turn them into Mind Flayers as well. You get to create your own character, select their race and class, and then from there determine if you'll use the strange powers that the worm gives you or deny them in the hopes that this keeps you from turning. You're joined on your quest to rid yourself of the worm by other infected individuals and must prove yourself in turn-based combat at various points in the plot. As you can see from our Baldur's Gate 3 review, this is a truly complex and impressive game, with dozens of choices that really do carry weight. 
However, sometimes you'll have to roll dice to see if your ideas are successful, and it's this mixture of luck combined with strategy that really makes things interesting, forcing you to stay on your toes while running through this fantasy world. Fighting zombies in outer space with supersonic gun slashing action can surely make your heart pump faster. The Doom franchise is known for being one of the coolest and most gruesome shooting games ever. The game has made a long-term history with its fighting mechanics, immersive graphics, and demon-killing action. You may need to optimize ROG Ally to run Doom Eternal with better graphics. The game is well-optimized, but we all want to hit that sweet spot of 1080p resolution at 60 frames per second. The storyline is packed with action and surprises so that we won't ruin that for you. Download Doom Eternal for free to experience the adrenaline-pumping action by playing this game in 2024. If you're downloading the EA app, you might as well check out the best EA game of 2023, Star Wars Jedi Survivor. It's another game that really pushes hardware on PC, so it's not the most obvious ROG ally friendly. While you'll have the best time if you're plugged in and using the Allies 30W Turbo mode, it's perfectly fine unplugged and on the go. In my testing, I was able to get between 30 to 40 FPS at 720p, on low settings, and with FSR set to quality. You can lock Jedi Survivor to 30 FPS for a consistent frame rate, but it is able to hover around 37 to 40 FPS most of the time. If you do want to play in a truly portable, i.e., unplugged, manner, then lock the game at 30 FPS on both 25W and 15W modes for a decent enough experience. Once you're set up and running, you'll find that playing Jedi Survivor on the Ally is an absolute blast. The game is available through EA's subscription service, EA Play Pro, and like with Assassin's Creed Mirage, that's plenty of time to finish. Of the games on this list, Elden Ring is one of the more graphically demanding ones. So, while the ROG Ally is unable to hit 60 FPS while playing it, it's still capable of running smoothly enough for players to enjoy in handheld mode as long as you adjust settings accordingly. You'll want to lower most settings to either low or medium to help the game run more smoothly. This is especially important when addressing texture quality, anti-aliasing quality, volumetric quality, water surface quality, and shader quality. Depth of field and motion blur settings can be set at whatever you'd like as they shouldn't affect performance much. As far as the plot goes, players enter a dark and gray fantasy world where the Elden Ring has been shattered and they must work to defeat the demigods who each hold a piece of it. Once all of the pieces are reunited, the main character will go from being one of the tarnished to the Elden Lord. But don't expect the journey to be easy. This is an extremely challenging adventure filled with powerful enemies and hostile landscapes. You'll need to learn from your past failures in order to do better and continue forward. If you keep with it, you'll be entertained for dozens of hours. Prepare yourself, because this game is sure to transport you into a different world. Starting in solitude, you are left to discover if there is more than a desolate sandscape with no way of talking to other characters. That is, until you are acquainted with someone just like you. While you can play completely alone, Journey has a special online multiplayer component where somewhere along the way, you might encounter another player with the same powers. You can travel together and only communicate through sound cues, so it creates a unique bond as you run around and explore together. After you complete your adventure, your usernames are revealed, giving you a chance to make a new friend. Diablo 4 is actually one of the main games I used when I was working on my ROG Ally review. It runs beautifully on the gaming handheld and also looks great thanks to that 1080p IPS display. I was able to play by tapping on the screen or by going into Command Center and changing to gamepad mode and using the buttons and joysticks. It runs well in 30W Turbo mode, or you can reduce it to 15W Performance mode if you'd like. Truth be told, the latest dive into Sanctuary isn't a very demanding game, but that means it won't have any problems running on the Ally. We've even got a handy guide on how to play Diablo 4 on Asus ROG Alley if you'd like further assistance. Story-wise, Diablo 4 centers around the fact that Lilith, the queen of the succubi, and one of the creators of the world known as Sanctuary, has been summoned back by cultists and is wreaking havoc among the people who live there. Players take on the role of a fighter who is either a sorcerer, barbarian, rogue, necromancer, or druid and fights back Hell's forces while trying to stop Lilith. It's a challenging hack and slash adventure that feels very rewarding when you level up your character effectively. Starfield is among the most demanding games of 2023. It doesn't even run at 60 FPS on Microsoft's most powerful Xbox Series X. 
that came as quite a surprise since 60 FPS had become an unspoken standard on the Series X up to now. You'd be forgiven then for thinking that Starfield is out of reach of handheld devices, but that's not the case. The ROG Ally runs the spacefaring RPG just fine at 30 FPS with the graphics turned down, equivalent to what the latest Xbox consoles are limited to. We absolutely love Hi-Fi Rush and recommend it to every ROG Ally owner who is interested in rhythm games. Since the game it isn't very demanding graphically or otherwise, you don't really need to worry about adjusting settings unless you really want to. Players take on the role of Chai, a young man who elects for a procedure that will give him a robot arm. However, the process goes wrong when his music player gets embedded in his chest, making him a defect. Now almost all of the bigwigs and robots at Vandalay Technologies are out to get him. The only way to fend them off is with his guitar-shaped trash grabber implant. Being one with his music player allows Chai to feel the unique rhythm of the world and fights back to the pulsing sounds. This is a very forgiving and approachable rhythm game since Chai is rewarded with extra damage dealt whenever players attack enemies to the beat but isn't punished if players miss a beat. Plus, now we know that it's getting the Arcade Challenge update to bring even more post-game modes and extras to the adventure. Let the sweet solitude begin as you venture into Firewatch's captivating forest scenery. Playing as Henry, you take on a new job as a fire lookout and soon find yourself in the middle of a strange mystery. Surrounded by beautiful sights accompanied by memorable voices and humorous conversations, this is one of my top picks for spending time with your ROG ally in handheld mode. It was many years back now that Fortnite's Battle Royal exploded into popularity. Thanks to the cartoony art style and simple mechanics it is in a very demanding game, and thus can run very smoothly on the ROG Ally. You can expect to get some really high FPS, which will only get better if you put the game in 15W performance mode. The main focus of the game revolves around having players jump out of the battle bus and onto the island below where they rush around trying to gather weapons and other loot. Your goal is to defeat all of the other players and be the last person or team standing. Along the way, you might find a dinosaur to ride or might find some small puzzles to solve. Since the game is so popular, it often gets crossover events which include character skins from other franchises. We've seen Master Chief from Halo, Kratos from God of War, Darth Vader from Star Wars, and much more. Best of all, Fortnite is completely free to play, although, there are optional in-game microtransactions for skins and the Battle Pass if you're interested. Racing games have always been a part of the top-tier titles, and there is no better game than Forza Horizon 5. The game offers amazing graphics, fluent gameplay, and an extensive class of vehicles which is why it's on our list of best games for Ace's ROG Ally in 2024. You can experience the fluent rubber-burning adrenaline-pumping action of Forza Horizon 5 on ROG Ally with the Turbo Mode. If you experience lag, you can also increase the RAM to get a more fluent experience in online multiplayer. If you dive into the series for the first time, you will love the immersive and addictive driving experience. You can also dock Asus ROG Ally on a larger display to get true automotive pleasure on a larger display. The ROG Ally console, with its high-performance hardware, provides a smooth and responsive gaming experience that perfectly matches the scale and complexity of the open world of Red Dead Redemption 2. Its ultra-fast processor and cutting-edge graphics card ensure stunning visuals, capturing every detail of the diverse landscape and deep characters of the game. Red Dead Redemption 2 is already praised for its breathtaking graphics, but on the ROG Ally, every sunrise, every gallop across the vast plains, and every encounter with the inhabitants of the Wild West takes on a whole new dimension. Visual details are amplified, creating a visual experience that transcends the boundaries between the real and the virtual. The ROG Ally also benefits from exceptional audio quality, allowing players to fully appreciate the enchanting soundtrack of Red Dead Redemption 2. From atmospheric music to realistic sound effects, immerse yourself in the immersive atmosphere of the Wild West with exceptionally clear sound. With its ergonomic design, the ROG Ally offers ultimate gaming comfort during long sessions in the Wild West. Responsive controls and an efficient cooling system allow players to stay focused on the captivating story of Red Dead Redemption 2 without being distracted by technical issues. The combination of the ROG Ally console with Red Dead Redemption 2 offers an unparalleled gaming experience, bringing together the raw power of ROG technology with the immersive storytelling of one of the most acclaimed games of our time.
Cyberpunk 2077 has had a really rocky ride having released in a truly horrible state in 2020, but several updates later the game finally plays the way it should have at launch. It's a gritty adventure revolving around Keanu Reeves' character, Johnny Silverhand, and is something you really shouldn't miss out on. As you might already know, this is one of the most graphically demanding games available right now, but that shouldn't deter you from playing it on the ROG Ally. To make the game run more smoothly, make sure to go into settings and reduce crowd density to low so you don't have quite as many NPCs running around and overworking the system. It's also best to lower local shadow, screen space reflection, SSR, subsurface scattering quality, SS, ambient occlusion, and level of detail, LOD, to low for a smoother gameplay experience. Although it's not nearly as pretty, you should also turn off ray tracing for improved performance. So, what is Cyberpunk 2077 about anyway? In this sci-fi adventure, you step into the shoes of V, a mercenary who gets involved with a job that ends up downloading the mind of a deceased terrorist into their head. Now the clock is ticking before it overwrites V's own personality and takes over. Players need to take down powerful gun-wielding enemies and infiltrate a large corporation in order to free V. It's a fantastic game that provides plenty of decision-making opportunities and challenging combat. Grand Theft Auto V, developed by Rockstar Games, is an iconic game that delivers a vast and dynamic gaming experience. While exploring the fictional streets of Los Santos, players can engage in captivating missions, participate in high-speed races, or simply enjoy the detailed in-game environment. On the ROG Ally console, these elements come to life with exceptional graphical quality, offering total immersion in the world of virtual crime. The ROG Ally's display, equipped with advanced technologies, brings the GTA V universe to life spectacularly. Visual details, vibrant colors, and high resolution ensure an unparalleled visual experience. Whether you're speeding through busy streets or planning heists, each moment is rendered with exceptional clarity. The internal power of the ROG Ally ensures smooth and responsive gameplay, a crucial feature for a dynamic game like GTA V. Quick transitions between actions, intense combat, and car chases are handled seamlessly, providing a seamless and immersive gaming experience. GTA V also features a multiplayer mode, GTA Online, where the ROG Ally particularly excels. Thanks to its online connectivity and processing power, the ROG Ally delivers a smooth and lag-free multiplayer experience, allowing players to immerse themselves in a persistent world of missions, races, and activities with other players worldwide. Playing GTA V on the ASUS ROG Ally is more than just a gaming experience. It's a fascinating dive into a virtual world filled with adventures, possibilities, and action. Whether you're a fan of solo missions or prefer to venture into the dynamic world of online multiplayer, the ROG console ensures an exceptional gaming experience at every moment. Call of Duty Modern Warfare Game Line is one of the pioneers of RPG shooting games. Modern Warfare 2 was a huge hit for multiplayer on PC, and now the third version is living up to its standards across all platforms. COD Modern Warfare 3 offers both campaign and multiplayer modes, which makes it one of the best co-op and multiplayer games to play on ASUS ROG Ally in 2024. ASUS ROG Ally's processor is powerful enough to run COD 3 on 60fps at 1080p resolution. The graphics experience is exceptionally gorgeous with a lifelike appearance. The gameplay experience in multiplayer is more than just acceptable, and you can enjoy the action with your friends on PC in the online gameplay via ROG Ally. Few of the best JRPGs can say they have a following as big as Persona 5 Royale, the adventure game that revolves around a group of high schoolers and their vigilante alter egos, or Personas. In our Persona 5 Royale review, we praised the game's charming cast and deep combat system. It really is an engaging adventure, especially for fans of anime. If that at all sounds appealing, you'll need to play it on ROG Ally. What really makes Persona 5 Royale special is how deep it dives into character personalities and student relationships. You'll find yourself pulled into the story with its various twists and turns bringing you back for more. Since the art style and gameplay aren't super demanding, you won't have to deeply adjust settings to optimize it for the handheld. Feel free to keep the resolution at 1080p and only make settings changes as you personally see fit. You might find it better to play in the ROG Ally's 15W performance mode. So, did you like the games I recommended? So leave your like, subscribe to the channel to follow me and activate the bell because I post a lot of videos on this channel and you can't miss it. I would like to remind you that in the description we have a list of different products that can make your gaming experience much better. If you want to buy, the link will be in the description. Anyway, 
Thank you very much for following me this far and until next time, bye.